G'day guys, today I'm going to give you a quick run through on how to upload high quality videos taken on another camera such as a DSLR or a GoPro to Instagram for Android. The program I'll be using is MPEG Stream Clip which is a free program available for both Mac and Windows and it's pretty easy to use so yeah, you just drag in your clip find some in and out points using the I and O keys on your keyboard and then go file export to MPEG4 make sure it's on H.264 limit the data rate to 5000 kilobytes per second set the audio to mono 441 kilohertz and then we have to change the frame size so mine's 1920 by 1080 and we need to change it to 640 by 640 so it's square and small enough for Instagram now what it's going to do is it's going to scale it all to fit that size so the aspect ratio will have changed so it'll look a bit a bit weird but some some videos it'll look fine so you can leave it like that or if you just want to crop out the sides and keep it looking normal just take off 420 or pixels off both sides off the source um, if if it's 1080p and then everything else is fine you can see that the file size is going to be pretty small you can always turn up that quality a bit and click make mp4 so we want to save it call it upload Save it, and that will export. Alright, now we need to get it onto your phone, uh, so you can use Bluetooth, Dropbox, um, you can email it to yourself, or you can use the USB data transfer cable. I'm going to use Bluetooth. And next is 4, send file. And then, yeah, click send. You have to accept it on my phone. And then we'll cut to what you have to do on your phone. Alright, now we've got the file on our phone in our gallery. We just find it, grab it there. Then, using the share, share button, we'll share it to Instagram. Because um, this is the only way you can get Instagram to work with the video. It doesn't work going into Instagram and then finding the video for some reason. Um, so I've already got it 15 seconds long, so I don't have to trim anything off. It's all good. So we go next. You can add all your filters and stuff. It's all the same as if you're uploading a photo. Go next. Choose a random cover frame. And next. And then, yeah. You just got to caption it. And that's all there is to it. I hope hope this has helped you. Uh, certainly took me a while to figure out, but it's good now that I've got it worked out. And yeah, thanks for watching.